Galorum is the antagonist of the series Accelerators. She's a robot, a drone, and... A drone exists for only one purpose. To race. That's why the Accelerons created us. But then they began to fear us. They were afraid because we would do anything to win. Even if it meant destroying our creators. The Accelerons left us behind when they returned to their own world. Left us stranded here on the Earth. The Wheel of Power is the key that will open the way back to the Accelerons. But only humans could get the wheel. So the drones waited deep inside the earth, dormant for thousands of years, waiting for humans to learn to use what the Accelerons had left them. We waited so long, Kadi. What? <sighs> what did they leave for us? Do you really not know? Tesla hasn't told you. He doesn't know. Soon, you'll know everything. No. No. Was abandoned by her creators for the one thing she was made for. Now you tell me what you would do if your sole purpose, if the one thing you were good at was the same thing you were rejected for. What would you do? You would try and prove them wrong. You would keep trying until you were the best, and stop at nothing until it was achieved. Which is what Galorum does. Galorum displays human characteristics like... Recon drones. You'll have to find your own line. Understood. Intelligence. Using tools to help her faction win the race in order to prove her creators wrong. She also displays her ability to. Your memories have been downloaded into a new unit. If you fail again, I'll race them. I will not fail instill fear through threats, which in turn makes other drones scared in order to make them better. Galorum, because of her intelligence, knows this and uses human nature to her advantage to make her drones adapt, to make her drones better and to make them... Explain to me why the sweeper isn't finished. There were unforeseen problems. We have to be ready before the humans learn to use the Excel chargers. More efficient through fear because she is impatient, another human characteristic. She could easily replace the drone captain but doesn't, instead wants them to improve, much like a human characteristic. Galorum also displays... We cannot let the humans stop us from getting all the Accelerachargers. We need a new way to defeat them. Something they haven't seen. Something no one has ever seen. Innovation. Adaptability. Creativity to overcome problems to win the races through making sweepers. Galorum is also cunning. It seems that your brother has abandoned you once again. And even if your metal maniac teammates wanted to rescue you, they couldn't. Your situation is completely hopeless, unless you tell me the location of the Accelodrome. You know the first thing I learned in prison? Never tell anybody 
anything. We may not be able to change your mind. She knows what it's like to be abandoned, which is why she empathizes with Maki to begin with. Empathy, in which she offers a solution to get what she wants, because she knows human nature will break, just as she did. She also has... You're weak. You humans think you're strong. Only machines are strong. Do you understand how weak you are? Flesh and blood. Jealousy, because she couldn't get the Wheel of Power while the humans could. The tracks were designed for humans, and she is jealous of the humans, which is why she discriminates against them, which is why she experiments on them, which is why she even calls them humans at all, because just as we humans call animals animals, she does so to humans. Galorum is also... Anger, because she was winning but is now losing. Anger, because of her abandonment. All of her actions are taken out of anger because... I must do what I was programmed to do. I might say the same. Galorum. Drones were created to race against the Accelerons. And now you have given me the means to face them again. And finally defeat them. The Accela Chargers. Yes. The Racing Realms are the final challenge. The test that proves you deserve to race against the Accelerons. Of course. Now I have enough Accela Chargers to pass that test. To become a true Acceleracer and defeat the Accelerons. And destroy them. She wants to kill her creators because she wants to prove her driving skills before she kills them, because her insecurities are all about her purpose and all about the Accelerons. I completed the Racing Realms. I have won the right to be an Acceleracer. Now you have to race me. You use the Accelerator Chargers to complete the Realms. The other driver used his own skills. The Wheel of Power on Galorum's neck symbolizes a corrupt version of the Wheel of Power. Because the Wheel of Power is all about driving, she is tied to proving her racing skills. However, her necklace is green and black instead, symbolizing corruption and evil. Instead of using pure driving skills to complete races, she uses Accelerator Chargers, showing her cheating, corrupting nature of driving. That was the test. No! I was first! He is a true Acceleracer. She is metaphorically choked and chained by her corrupted Wheel of Power to winning the realms, but since she did it with the Accelerator Chargers and not her actual skills... think you've won, human. The only real victory is survival. The choke comes off along with her human skin, signifying she has failed her purpose and is no longer tied to what she was created for. Because the corrupted version of the wheel comes out, it also symbolizes that she is no longer tied to the need to race and therefore chooses to win through killing the other driver. With her human disguise coming off, it also signifies she has no understanding of her purpose, nor any other identity to the real her because she has failed at the one thing she was created for. She doesn't understand why the Acceleron chose her to be an Acceleracer, displaying no sportsmanship, which shows how humanity has left her. She is also defaulted to kill mode, which is why she turns more robotic looking. However, this just displays how much of a human she is. She is free from her programming and makes these conscious decisions, much like a human. 
And this, her ending displays her humanity, eternal torture, pain and suffering, because the Accelerons abandoned her. She tried to do what she was programmed for, to prove herself to them and to prove that she was good enough, but instead she failed again. She disappointed her creators, and that is the humanity of Galorum.